Elon Musk has said you started OpenAI, you both started OpenAI because he was scared of Google. Is Google still a threat? Google is like unbelievably competent and it seems like they're focused with an intensity Google has not seen in a while on AI. So they're still scary? They're, they're, they are a company that I don't think anyone should ever write off. Now, obviously, we've seen all the barbs that you and Elon have been trading in public and in interviews. Trading? Do I don't really. Well, you're responding. You respond. You get asked about it by people like me, to be fair. Mostly people like you, to be honest. Most other people ask about the technology, but right. that is true. Why, why do you think he's so frustrated or disappointed with the direction that OpenAI has gone? Um, I mean, you should ask him. He can give you a better answer than I can speculate. So. But I, like, I really am happy to talk about this, and this is the most important yeah. topic. We can spend the rest of the time yeah. on it. Um, Don't worry. I, I Not think, the rest of the time, just some. <laughs> I think he really cares about AI safety a lot. And I think that's where it's coming from a good place. And we just, like, you know, we have differences of opinion on some parts, but I mean, we both care about that. And he wants to make sure we have, like, the, we, the world, have the maximal chance at a good outcome. So you're not worried he's going to call you out and kind of call you to come to some cage match in, Ve in the Vegas octagon? I don't, I don't you think just I would did with Mark Zuckerberg. But I kind of, I would go watch if he and Zuck actually did that. Like, All right, well, it's supposedly happening between him and Zuck. I, crazy. I think those, there will be quite an audience. Look, you know, there is, much has been made of the Microsoft relationship, and, and it's not just him, you know. Uh, but he has said he's worried that Microsoft has more control than the leadership at OpenAI realizes and that they could cut you off at any point. Is that true? I mean, I think what he means is that they could, like, break the contract and, you know, take away our access to the data center. And a lot of money that you have access to, right? We have money. It's the data center that, like, they operate for us. I don't think that's a likely scenario for a bunch of reasons. How would you characterize the relationship with Microsoft? We think it's great. I, I mean, like any deep, complex relationship, it's not without its challenges, but it's really great. It is by far the best major partnership I've ever been a part of. Um, it's kind of like, on both sides, it was kind of a crazy thing to jump into, and it's uh, surprising that it works this well, but if you just like look at the results from both companies, we're, we're very happy.